Hello again, it's HK Fanatic, and I'm going to give you a quick look over at my now modified Force FX lightsaber, uh, the Darth Vader model, with, uh, of course, I have removed the, uh, the actual blade with all the LEDs inside. Now before you're thinking, why are you going to go and do something crazy like that? Um, first of all, the way I did it, which requires a little, so you know, a little soldering and just basic you know, wire savvy, which anyone can do with the soldering gun with a little practice. The handle is not difficult to take apart. So this module, I'm not going to go over the details, but to give you a quick breakdown, all you need to do to take this apart, remove these two screws here, remove these from the side, which will allow you to remove the front cam. Uh, the actual front uh, hood off that covers the emitter. This screw here will allow you to remove the entire switch assembly. Inside will be a switch with some wires running down through a hole underneath this uh, secondary uh, cover for the actual handle itself. Now, you will either have to cut the wires to the switch because there's two wires running to it or remove the solder joints, which I did, which allowed me to, again, Take it apart. The electronics module, this is uh, just the battery and the actual sound card and speaker and the actual electronics are in here. And of course the front of the uh, LED section of the uh, of your uh, electronics. Now the problem is how to get everything back together so that it will work and be, you know, operational. I'll cover that in the next module. But as you can see, fully operational. Motion sensor still works. Got a great backup that you can mount for your, you know, under your belt for your uh, costume party or going out as a as your Jedi robe on. And of course, I, I, you really can't see it in here, but if you look down in the bottom of the actual electronic the upper electronic section is the actual connector sitting in there if I was going to reconnect it all I would have to do is simply resolder the wires and tape them and the unit would work just fine I, I have two of them that's the only reason I did it for this because I always wanted to have a good handheld well for the first part of this this is HK Fanatic and Tail Part 2.